awesome. I mean, listen, there's been a lot of ups and downs, and in the first two years, probably more downs than ups. Uh, but this this program is fighting its way the right way. We're getting closer and closer to where we want to be, which is, you know, uh, playing in, in that NCAA tournament and uh, didn't have it. You know, it wasn't our best game or anything, but the guys fought and fought and fought and down the stretch executing. I thought it was the most selfless game we had all year because in the second half we realized we, we finally realized that they couldn't stop Wyatt and we didn't force any shots. We just kept feeding them and then when they started to double, Wyatt made the plays to pass the ball out and make plays for other guys. Uh, made our free throws down the stretch. Got a big stop, one big stop that we needed and uh, uh, just really, really proud of these guys because you know, it's something the school's never done. You know, winning a postseason game, it's something Sanford's never done. We talked a, a lot about because let's keep it real. Everybody wanted to play in the NCAA tournament. There's that natural letdown when you lose in a SOCON. And one of the things I talked to this team about was making history. Winning 20 games, they were the fifth team since they've been in Division One history here at Sanford to do it. Uh, winning a postseason game, first time ever. If we go in, and I told him, I said, well, now we're, we're, not, well, now we, we're entrenched in it now. We won one. Why not go win it all? You win four more, you're going to tie the, the highest record, uh, the best record ever since Division One with 24 wins. So I said, I said we might as well go ahead and do some, make some history while we're here. I think you just take it one game at a time. Uh, you try to, I mean, you, you get kind of late notice on these things, so you try to prepare as best you can. I mean, there's that's where I like, you know, it's one of those things I can't I can't get real mad. I just try to teach on the fly, but there's some things that that if we had an extra day, you probably take away some of the layups that they were getting down there in the second half. But uh, in the way this tournament's set up, you kind of got to make, you know, be able to make some plays on the fly and just make a play. And I thought our guys uh, did a great job of that considering we had one practice uh, of going over their stuff. Um, I thought, you know, during the week when we were just working our stuff, the guys were pretty competitive uh, on, on Friday, Saturday uh, and Sunday. So that probably led us to being able to be able to come out here and, and, and get this win. But, but like I said, what I'm really proud about is we have a lot of guys that can score the ball and sometimes we don't ride the hot hand as much as we need to and, and, and when Wyatt couldn't be stopped down there they just kept making the pass, kept making the pass and, uh, and it, it did good, great things for us in the second half.